It's been more than 150 years since Charles Darwin came up with his theory of evolution by natural selection. But some researchers believe they've uncovered a new understanding of how species evolve based on the way cane toads are adapting to Australia. It might be ugly and destructive, but this wart-covered creature is at the centre of an evolution debate. Natural selection is all about survival of the fittest. This new idea of spatial sorting really is about mating between the quickest. Introduced in the 1930s to fight the cane beetle, cane toads have been on the hop ever since. Some scientists believe toads are getting quicker and developing longer legs. These researchers say the new traits are putting toads at greater risk of being eaten by predators and developing arthritis. And this goes against Charles Darwin's idea that survival of the fittest benefits a species. So there's all kinds of difficulties with being a fast-moving toad. It doesn't really look as if natural selection is the process that has fashioned that really distinctive-looking animal. He says the new concept isn't as important as natural selection, but it does add to ideas about evolution. There's a reasonable chance that in the same way the Galapagos finches are the poster kids for natural selection, I think the cane toad may turn out to be the poster kid for spatial sorting. Other scientists believe more research needs to be done to shore up the concept. I think they've, what they've done is they've raised our awareness of an idea that has perhaps been a bit of a sleeper idea for a long time and they've brought it to the forefront using cane toads as a, as a, as a good model um, for this idea. But like most things in evolution, it can be very, very difficult to demonstrate. But probably not as difficult as stopping the cane toads. Jano Gibson, ABC News.